That's pink. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Backyard Football. I am Coach Tony here on Screen Peekers, and today's the day. It is the super colossal cereal bowl. The Seahawks have had a stellar season, almost going undefeated, losing one game in the regular season, and have made our way to the big game. But none of it matters if we don't win today. This is for all the marbles. It's the Seahawks versus the Pigskins. This is what we've worked all year for. This is why we run two-a-days. This is why we put the work in. Two teams walk in. One team walks out the champion. Who's it going to be? Super Colossal Cereal Bowl on the line. Seahawks, Pigskins. Let's get it on. Here we go. At the king size dome for the super colossal cereal bowl. So excited to be playing on such a huge platform. See if we can do it. Let's see if we can take home this title. Let's go. The amazing pigskins. Seattle Seahawks. Look at that. What a kick by Ricky. And touchback. Not even giving Jerry a chance. And we got to start it off on the ground. Lou Ann Louie. She's got to have a big game for us today. She's got to have a big game for us. There she goes, busting through the hole. Good run. Way to cut. few cuts there. That's what I'm talking about. Let's run it back. Let's run it back. Luann Louie, she's got to get hot and stay hot for us today. This is going to be a huge part of our game plan. We're going to have to need... Oh, no, this is not looking good. Oh, what a block. What a block. What a block. Oh, the fumble. Not a way you want to start. Lou and Louie busted a huge run and then fumbles. Hey, that one said it was going to be easy. We're going to blitz until they prove they can stop it. We're going to blitz until they prove they can stop it. Oh, Pete misses the tackle. But Ahmed doesn't. Ahmed's there to clean it up. We got to do something special here. We are on our back foot, and this is not what we wanted. Someone get her. No one can tackle her. She is a beast. She is a beast. But we got a third and two. We can stop her right here. Force a field goal would be huge. Lisa, she's going to march down the middle. She's going to take it to the house. And the Pigskins take an early lead. Lisa Crockett would not be denied. Right down Main Street into the end zone. Seahawks playing from behind is not something they are used to here. And the kick is good, and the Pigskins go up 7-0. Reeling a little bit, reeling. We got to answer back, and we have to answer back now. Jerry Rice takes the kick. These kids are fast. They are juiced up, ready to play. Pigskins are here, but we got a trick up our sleeve. Trips right, three-headed dog, Cerberus on go. Let's go. Here we go. Let's do it. Let's do it. Tried and true. Tried and true. There he is, Jerry Rice. He catches the pass. He's high-stepping to the end zone. The Seahawks answer back immediately. And that's what we needed to see. Let's go. I got to be honest. Got a little scary. A little scary there. But way to answer back immediately. Love the fight out of this team. Been seeing it all year long. What a kick by Maria. She's juiced up. And we are all tied up at seven. Let's go. Huge kick by Maria. Maria is on one today. Touchback. Love it. All right. We're going to drop back into defense a little bit. Drop back into D. Into the zone. Ahmed sheds the block, makes the tackle. Not letting it happen again. Short gain. We'll take that. Get there, Ahmed. Ahmed! Ahmed stepping up today. Love to see that. 
Third down. We got to get a third down stop here. Get there. Jerry gets there. Jerry gets there. Had to shed a block at the end, but he gets there. Huge stop for the Hawks. Here we go. Jerry Rice collects it. He's going to take it to the 30, and he's tackled. But good field position for the Hawks. And we're going to give it back to Luan Louis. We got to boost her confidence again. You cannot be afraid. The run was working. She, had, she busted it twice. No, don't throw it. Still a little shaken up. She's still a little shaken up. It's okay. We'll go back. We'll go back. She's still a little shaken up. I wish it wasn't a pass. I want to be able to navigate with her, but she can't. You can't do it. So we got to go to the pass. We got to go to the air. But that's all right. We're going to feel good about going to the air. We're going to feel good about going to the air right here. Cross the middle. Lou and Louie. Jukin. And now we got decision time. Now we have decision time. Fourth and 11 from the 23. We're going to go for it. We're going to do it. Super. Someone's going to be open across the middle. We're hoping for it right here. Big play. Big play early in this game. Maria. And it's intercepted. Ricky comes up with a huge play for the pigskins. Probably should have took the points there. Probably should have took the points. But been aggressive all year. Didn't want to stop now. Been aggressive all year. Didn't want to stop now. Jerry Rice, though. Jerry Rice getting back there. Shutting it down. Shutting it down. Let's go. Sally on the bootleg. Ahmed chasing her. All right. All right, third down, another big third down here. Sally Dobbs, dangerous quarterback, dangerous quarterback. Ahmed stopping it again, getting a huge third down stop there. Fourth and three from the 35. They got to punt that. They got to be punting. Thank you. So no harm, no foul on the interception there. No harm, no foul. Jerry Rice. Get around the edge and he fumbles. Another fumble. Lisa Crockett's going to scoop it. She's going to take it down the sideline, and she's going to score. Pigskins take the lead again. Oh, the moment is just seeming like it's too big for the Seahawks right now. The moment seems too big for the Seahawks right now. 12 seconds before the half. They have to answer back. This is troublesome. And an onside kick almost recovered by the pigskins, but Ahmed able to fall on it. They got eight seconds, so you know where we got to go. Trips right, three-headed dog, Cerberus on go. We need it. We've, ne we, we've never needed it this badly. One-on-one, -on -one. Sally Dobbs is not to be denied. Big interception by Sally. Four turnovers for the Seahawks in the first half, and you're just not going to win a ball game that way. You are not going to win a ball game that way. And that's the half. Seahawks down at half. Second half. It's going to be a big one. Here we go. Second half down seven. Not looking good for the Hawks right now. We got to turn things around. We got to turn things around quickly. Got to kick off. Not what we wanted to see. But this team can handle adversity. There we go. That is a huge start to the half. Pin them back. We're going to have to be aggressive here. We're going with the all-out blitz while they're pinned back. And it's going to pay off. And it's going to pay off. Huge play. Ahmed Khan. Let's go. The safety. And that is the lifeline the Seahawks needed. Two points and the ball coming back to the Hawks. Absolutely huge plays. Lou and Louie, don't fumble. Okay, she didn't fumble. We're going to answer back right now. We knew it was an interception last time, but it's three-headed dog. Cerberus on go right now. Right now. Back to 
to Lou and Louie and she can't connect. He faked everybody out. He faked everybody out. Everyone knows on that play, you're going to Jerry Rice. He decided to go across the middle to Lou and Louie wide open and she couldn't connect. Let's try again. Let's try it again. They got this deep pass covered. There he is wide open. Jerry Rice, he catches, he collects it, and he gets tackled down to the 30. He, he couldn't can't stay on his feet after he caught it. He couldn't stay on his feet, but a huge first down. And now we're going to run the ball. Now we're going to run the ball. Let's go, Luan. I believe in you. There she goes. Good run inside the red zone. Inside the red zone. And now we're going to do the bootleg with Pete Wheeler. They're never going to see it coming. There he goes. There he goes. Almost a first down. Almost a first down. Third and inches. Flip it and rip it. Do it again. Do it again. Third and inches. Pete Wheeler to the corner. And he's going to score. The Seahawks are back on top. Let's go. Let's go, Pete Wheeler. Huge. Doing it with the legs. And now we're only up one. We got to go for two. We got to go for two here. And we're doing the same thing. Pete Wheeler once again. And he's in there. He's too quick. He's too quick. The two-point conversion. And the Seahawks go up three. What a game. What a game. Now it's up to the defense. Maria with another booming kick. Get there, Jerry. That a boy, Jerry, pinning him deep inside the 10 once again. And you know what we got to do. It worked out last time. We got to get aggressive one more time here. One more time. Huge. Ahmed Khan taking matters into his own hands. Keep it rolling. Do it again. Do it again. Ashley! Ashley! Ashley with another safety! The Seahawks have turned things around here in the second half. Ahmed Khan picking it up. He's going to run to the outside. But he didn't lose the ball. That's all I cared about. And here we go. Power sweep to Luan Louie. Start running this clock out. Last play of the third quarter here. There she goes. She could have broke one tackle. She would have been off to the races. Second and 12. I'm scared to throw because they're going to pick it off every time. We're going to keep it going on the ground. Fourth quarter here. So close to the promised lands. We win. Not enough room to operate there. Not enough room to operate, but now we're going to go back to Pete Wheeler. See if we can pick up this first down. Keep that clock moving. The blitz. Couldn't get around it. The corner blitz stifled it. Stifled. Fourth and ten from the 39. I hate to do it, but we got to punt. I hate to do it, but we got to punt here. We got to be smart. Got to pin them back. We have to pin them back. Have to pin them back. Touchback. Not good. Wish I could have. Wish I could have stopped it from being so deep. But that's okay. We got to get a stop here. Got to get a stop. They need a touchdown. And there's Lisa, and she's gonna take it. Jerry could make the tackle. The Seahawks are chasing her, and nobody's gonna catch her. Lisa Crockett down the sideline to the house. The Pigskins regain the lead. Lisa Crockett, a force to be reckoned with. Oh. The Pigskins go up 20. They're going for two to try to go up by three, and not gonna happen. All we need is a field goal. A field goal to win the championship. Seahawks down one. My gosh. The drama. You got to get out of bounds. Okay. 32 seconds left. Got to try it on the ground. This is intense. This is what you hope for out of a super colossal cereal bowl. 
No good. No good. Gotta go to the air. Gotta go to the air. Gotta go to the air here. We need about 40 yards. Gotta go to the air. Ricky Johnson with the interception! The downfall! Just the defense is too good with these turnovers. It's not good. Not good for the Seahawks. They gotta get a stop immediately. Time is running out. There's Pete! They gotta be quick with it. They need it to be quick. They need a turnover quick. Time is running out for the Seahawks. Ashley Weber there again. Huge plays. Got to get one more. Got to get one more big stop here. We're going to go a little, little safe with it. Going to go a little safe with it. Jerry, get off the block. Fumble! Oh, but Lisa picks it up. Tackled 15 seconds left. Fourth down. Getting the ball back. This is pressure. This is the championship. This is what you want to see out of your championship game. Jerry Rice is going to collect it. He's going to try to pick up as much as he can. And he's going to fumble. He's going to fumble. And Ricky Johnson is going to take it to the house. Nail in the coffin for the Seahawks. Ricky Johnson can't believe it. The fans can't believe it. Unbelievable turn of events for the Seahawks. And if it's not a kick return for a touchdown, this game is over. Seahawks down eight. The, the amazing season coming to an end. Unless Lou Ann Louie can make some magic and she gets tackled and there you have it. The Seahawks fall short at the finish line. Chuck Downfield here with a uh, post-game interview with Coach Tony. Thanks, Coach, for sparing some time for us. Tough game out there. Not how you want to see the season end. But what do you have to say about that game today? Uh, yeah, uh, thanks, Chuck. Um, tough, tough day. Tough day. You really just feel for those those players in there. They, they played their hearts out. Um, they did it all year long. They, they left everything on the field. And uh, I'm proud of them for fighting back um things looked bleak in the first half came out of the gate strong there in the second half and just uh couldn't go the distance with it and uh you know huge congratulations to the pigskins that is a extremely talented team on that side tenacious defense uh just speed and you know hats off to them you know they 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 came in they took it today they they played better they deserve the win um uh, you know i just got to tell my guys to keep their heads up they had a solid season um you know it's it's tough it's tough to win this thing and you know i'm proud of them for what they did accomplish this year do you have any thoughts heading into next season what you might try to accomplish we know with contracts and things like that a lot can change but what are your thoughts going into next season yeah uh, i mean Still just reeling from this one. I'm not going to be thinking about that for a while. Just going to try to soak this in and uh, make sure that, um, you know, whatever does happen, you know, we have a chance to think about it, talk about it with my family. And uh, for now, just thinking about this game, um, you know, wish I could change it. A lot of things could have went the other way. Um, a lot of decisions I made, you know, weren't great decisions. And um, six turnovers, that's tough tough to overcome so i'm um, not really thinking about the future right now just thinking about this game and uh, you know trying to improve and uh move on eventually thanks coach for your time we appreciate talking to you all season long we hope to see you again soon best of luck i appreciate it thanks chuck and there you have it the season ends with a tough loss in the super colossal cereal bowl. Just didn't have what it takes at the end of the game. Too many turnovers in big spots. Had an opportunity and literally fumbled it away. It was a great season. Team played hard, had fun. We played our best, but the other team just played better. Said an emotional Pete Wheeler, the Seahawks star quarterback. I don't necessarily agree with that. I don't think we played our best, but, you know, we did what we did. When you play with a funny shaped ball, sometimes things don't bounce your way. That's what I said, and that's true. A lot of fumbles. A lot of fumbles hurt us today. But regardless, 
This season was a blast. I had so much fun coaching these kids. I had so much fun playing this game with all of you guys tuning in. I wish it would have ended better. I, I don't know what else to say. I'm more disappointed than anybody. It hurts. It hurts. I'm feeling emotional after this entire season, half a year long journey, just for it to, to come crashing down at the end like that. Felt good. I felt like we were in a good spot, just needing a field goal to win the game. And it hurts. That's all I can say. But thank you guys for tuning in all season long. I hope you guys enjoyed this season of Backyard Football. We'll see what 2022 brings us. We'll see what happens this fall. Do the Seahawks run it back? Do they have unfinished business and do they run it back? Do I move on? We'll see. We're going to find out. But thank you guys for tuning in. If you enjoyed this video at any time, do us a solid. Hit that thumbs up. Really help support the channel. If you're new and you haven't done it yet, hit that subscribe button down below so you don't miss all the Screen Peekers content we got on this channel. Lots of gameplays, Twitch VODs. We're streaming a lot at twitch.tv slash Screen Peekers Live. Come hang out with us there. Catch the Twitch VODs here on YouTube. We got news videos. We got countdown videos. A lot of cool stuff coming. You're not going to want to miss it, so hit that subscribe button down below. Hey, there might be more backyard sports. We'll see. More than just football? Maybe. We'll see. But thanks for tuning in. I hope you guys hope you guys feel better than I feel right now. But we'll see you next time. Keep on peeking.